eccentric, colorful, spiritual, motivational, encouraging is exactly what I was looking forward to when I booked the Naomi ticket. And just as Jesus would have it, he surpassed my expectations. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I take you through a journey or a vlog as you would have it of the day I was in the same room, breathing the same air, having my accent changed for a few minutes, okay? With Naomi Rain, the Maverick City star, a prophetic worshiper, somebody I look up to, somebody that carried me, especially when I was starting my job um, last year in February. I had been introduced to her prior to that, but I just dived more into her music and more of her vlogs and everything on her channel. Songs like, I find my peace in you, make us one. Oh my God, such songs honestly just brought me so closer to Jesus and made me friends with the Holy Spirit. So I definitely had to get that ticket. The cherry on top was the fact that I purchased the ticket with my first paycheck as a permanent employee at my job so that to me felt like a let's go girl we're doing this you know so proud of myself it was a celebration i know it's on the first of april it feels like an april fool's joke it feels like it's not real but real or not we are in there like swimming <laughs> ladies and gentlemen my name is mpote dile aka omnigazwayo is show that you're tuning on to today and to the new subscribers thank you so much you're welcome here thank you so so much guys to the returning subscribers thank you so much for sticking with your girl you are actually the people that made people see that this is a real channel okay if you were not there people would have not believed that this channel is alive so thank you for riding with me thank you for sticking with me the road has just begun okay things are just about to get better if you're passing by maybe you saw the link from a friend's page and you're like let me check it out take your time but not too long okay just click that red button just think about it as you're already a resident because this is home we're all welcome all my girls and my boys and everything in between yeah guys man please just enjoy the vlog don't leave the video without leaving me a like and a comment anyway guys let's yeah If you know me you know i love me a good time okay especially in the presence of the lord okay okay i had my few experiences as a groove girl okay even then <laughs> it went down one thing about me i will not seize a good time but being in the presence of the lord having fun in the presence of the lord nothing can ever compare i i don't like I don't even care what you think honestly i don't want a debate i don't want opposing thoughts i just know what i know so is true. this for me was just amazing it was an amazing experience with the saints especially having my sister right along um next to me you know having a great time with my sister is always a great time <laughs> i love experiencing things with my sister because it's just so genuine if it's a first time it's a first time and we're gonna scream okay we're gonna jump okay we're gonna ask for pictures okay we're gonna go in front of the cameras all right because we are just about that full experience all right this show was not anything different as we came in already we we're just crazy about the fact that we are at rayma bible church that thing is not a church okay that thing is an institution that thing is a university okay there is a bookshop there is there's just so much happening in rima bubble came in ria was absolutely hungry hmm? okay level so did you let chips stuck and obviously i saw a chip and dip and i was like i'm dipping that sauce from chip and dip <laughs> It doesn't even make sense let me need that but yeah we had food we went in got registered on the door and found our seats let me tell you something a miracle okay god being god god said 
Yabana Abbe City, we are touching doing a loot or irons, a shell and a macos. Tell me why we were moved to the VIP section, child. When I was so hacked, I was like, oh my god, you know what? In life, you win some, you lose some. But God said, hey, no, with Jesus, you win all. I started dancing like my life depended on it. I remember the owner of the seats came. Was I not moved? Were the ladies not livid? They were so angry. They were so angry talking about we paid 4,000 for these seats. I'm like, guys, this is Jesus' house. It don't matter. Money ain't value here, okay? Don't you remember he flipped the tables because they were selling a church? Now you come here and telling me about 4,000 rand. I also paid my 4,000 rand, okay? The money I paid is equivalent to 4,000 because I deny, yo. It didn't ruin an eye. My sister was just like, just continue being in the presence of the Lord, all right? So Brennan Praise came in as the first um, performer. Um, okay, this is the part where I free myself to have an opinion, to, to voice it out because, you know, it's, it's, it hasn't been something I really practice in my life, especially now on a public platform. Um, Brandon Prey's performance was not the one for me. Honestly, I did not enjoy it. I didn't connect with him. And I could tell from the room as well that there wasn't really much connection. But I don't know how other people felt, but I didn't connect to the performance. But I still danced, I still jammed, sang to the songs that I knew. But um, yeah, that wasn't. <laughs> came on stage i didn't know her music i've seen her on screen once or twice she came on great testimonies healing music it's just so beautiful like that's it's that kind of music that you just sit in the house with you know and it just reminds you of the greatness of the lord also amazing and very colorful his songs hey, hey. even the visuals like he's your okay let me not lie i don't know genres okay like that but says as those tanda lulucha ebona ila mitulo yolucha Choice. All lessons for giving. 
Worshippers are eternal. <laughs> ah, evangelists will cease when they die. Prophets will stop when they die. But in heaven, worship will continue forever. Ah! You cannot kill a worshipper. You cannot destroy a worshipper. You cannot discourage a worshipper. Bishop Sikiti was just full of power. You know what? The running um, theme for the weekend, like moving from Jesus this, Jesus that revival to that um, concert now, I feel like it was just the glory, you know, the glory of the Lord. Because even when Bishop Sikiti was preaching, he touched on that. So, and even when Naomi was performing, which I'm going to get to, um, she was just like, she was sent to spread the glory of the Lord across the world you know even the song i think that she started with that was not released that was just performed um to us so we got it first anyway yeah i feel like that was the running theme innocent side she was amazing as an mc she was incredible she made me feel like i can do this you know i love me people who do that when they do their job that they're so exceptional but at the same time they're not far like to reach like they make you feel like i can also do this it was very inspirational she was she just did her thing man got off the stage called people made us laugh she looked amazing also i also look up to her because she's also a preacher she's just into ministry i haven't found like my direct line of ministry if i can call it that so i double between this and that because i know it's prophetic it's worshipy yeah i don't know what it is it's preachy sometimes so people that have all these traits that i see in myself i gravitate towards their content so yeah she was amazing i absolutely love the fact that she was the one who was hosting that thing and the fact that she was fangirling naomi like it was so obvious she was even telling us to buckle up because an american is here like she was so direct the true worshipers will worship the lord in, in truth, truth and in spirit and you're still sitting down when an American is waiting out oh for you, when you've waited she the whole night a true, for that um, moment, that definition time. of 
when grace locates you but not only that because she is so well educated she also shows the importance of preparation and being prepared for the moment so i'm learning a lot from oh my god the star the moment of the moment the matter of the matter the situation to the sea way yeah. blue our minds people lost their morals people were just in front they left their seats I was just like, is this even allowed, guys? We're in Remar. This is not a uh, Ito, Ito. But hey, it was a great time. But yeah, guys, I hope um, you enjoyed this vlog. Memories are still fresh in our minds. I have not even gotten over Jesus, this Jesus, that. I don't even know how I'm going to get over the Naomi one. I don't even know, man. That weekend was a lot. Because then after that weekend, it was the weekend of the Passover, which was too much again. Because I got to experience Le and Kaya. And Rorisang is my best friend now. Kemi, Kemi, my best friend. Okay? If y'all don't know that you're my best friends, <laughs> now you know. Is it my fault that you learned this on YouTube? Uh, no, because why are you not serious about life? Like, how do you not know that you're my best friend? But yeah, guys, God is good. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you like the video. Do not leave without subscribing. If you haven't, please do the right thing. I love you. We'll catch you on the next one. Goodbye.
mm. for a specific amount of time. Mm. Too long. And when it's over, when the time is up, the time is up. But I believe the Lord is healing the church. Yes. Amen. Amen. Not Amen. Physically, but mentally and emotionally. And he's not just healing the church. He's making the church a healing center for those on the outside that don't know where to find peace, don't know where to find hope. Because God will work it out. forget the very foundation yes. the very cornerstone this whole thing is hinged on him Come on. our worship is about Jesus and it's only because of Jesus that we can stand in a room and God says this is acceptable that we're not out there slaughtering animals but there was blood that was shed on our behalf and I can't go anywhere without talking about that. I think sometimes we try to skip forward and try to get to the deeper things. I wanna tell you, faith in Jesus is not the milk. I think sometimes we think that. Jesus says there are things, he said to his disciples, there are things I wanna tell you, but I can't tell you yet. You're not ready for them. So there's a revelation of Jesus that is the meat. It's for the mature. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yes. And so, Father, we worship you. I don't even know. I, I want to just say in this moment, I always want to give people an opportunity to get to know the real Jesus. A lot of us go to church. We do church. But we don't relate and have a relationship with Jesus. 
And I know some of you are probably used to an altar call where you have to come up and you have to raise your hand and you have to cry. <laughs> but I want to invite you in this moment into a deeper relationship with Jesus. Yeah.